Okay, take three, four, five. Okay, so all of the really cool and fun trails are the complete other end of the trail network for me. Uh, so that's where the escarpment elevation is. That's where Rush and Rodeo and Berm Trail and Rockabilly all are. So to get there from where I usually start my rides, uh, I ride this green downhill, which we're gonna hit as fast as we can to make it a little more fun. And that takes me all the way down to the creek. And then I ride two uphills that take me up to the pipeline, which gets me to the other end of the trail network. So we're gonna do a top to bottom run on this trail here, which is called Pines. And it takes us all the way to the creek. And then we're gonna do a bottom to top on a short little bit on Tongues Out, but then on uh, Interface and Hill Part Two. Very inspired name there. Um, so that's gonna be a lot of fun. And uh, let's see how it goes. So we're starting out at Laurentian Ski Hill area again. I know that's a shocker and all my videos have been there, but I promise I have something new coming shortly. Uh, we're coming across Janie Street Trail is where I start, then I go down the connector and into Pines. And Pines is a nice gentle uh, downhill slope, but we'll ride it really quick to make up for that and keep it interesting. And once we get to the end of Pines, we're down at the creek where Tongues Out is. And we just do a short ride on Tongues Out over to Interface and Hill Part 2, which is shown in reverse on Trail Forks, but is an uphill for us. This is actually just above Pines. This is a Janie Street Connector, but I don't know. I'm in the middle of a whole bunch of Pines, so I consider it the same thing. Pick your fastest gear, and you will run out of gear on this run, but it is super fun. So here we go. Pretty popular uh, walking trail too, so we're into pines now, obviously. A little burned corner there. Lots of pine needles though, so don't go too crazy. I like to bunny hop that little stump. I hope you're getting a feel for how fast and how loose this is. It's just a slight downhill grade the whole way down. Shortcut to the left here. We're gonna do the whole trail. Two banked corners. Woo. They are slippy. And you go into the left. All the way down to the creek. This line's fun. And you come right down to the creek here. Couple options here, but this steep part is more fun than the other. All right, that's pines. Get you all the way down to the creek. Really, really fast, flowy. And because I keep the video short, we're gonna go straight into uh, a little segue here on Tongues Out, which I covered in another video. And then we jump into Interface and a really creatively named trail called Hill. Somebody was getting really tired at the computer at Trail Forks. That's all right. So this is Tongues Out and then we veer left onto the newly named interface. Just a short bit of trail here to get us to the climb. Optional, uh, there's some line options there. I think right here we intersect with Sidewinder going down, and then a trail called Hill Part 2 going up, which gets us to the pipeline. It's got some fun climbs in here. straight up or around to the side here. You can hear me breathing so you know why I went to the side. A 
go up and down. And then a nice little tech climb right up to the pipeline. This is pretty cool. Lots of lines here. Most of us sneak right between these rocks. A couple surges and you're here. And that's it. That's Pines Interface and Hill. And we're up to the trail network, close to Rodeo Russian Berms. Cool. So that's the first video with a top to bottom run and then a bottom to top run combined. We rode down pines, up interface and uphill to get to the pipeline. And all of that was to show you how to get out to the far end of the trail network to ride all the awesome trails. If this is helpful and you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more trail videos in the future, feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell and you'll see them when I'm done. Thanks again. Hope to see you on the trails. Bye.